and we will continue with Institute for Reporters Freedom and Safety. Thank you. War in Ukraine has led to death and detention of many journalists. Only yesterday, a Wall Street Journal reporter Ivan Gershkovich was arrested in Russia on spying charge. The IRFS called for his immediate release. Situation with freedom of speech in the region is deteriorating due to Russian aggression against Ukraine. There is an unseen level of propaganda being used by Russian authorities in Russia itself, in the occupied parts of Ukraine and other our region countries. In Ukraine territories occupied by Russia, the occupation authorities use the censors to suppress local media. No true information can reach the local population. The most vulnerable people are the Crimean Tatars who have been living in under Russian occupation since 2014. Many countries in the region, such as Belarus, Georgia, Azerbaijan, and others, emulate Russian practice of suspension against critics. As a result, the general situation with the freedom of speech in the regions is a worsening. War in Ukraine also put into the difficult position many NGOs in neighboring countries. There is a clear decrease of democratization program in the post-Soviet space. Ukrainian today is clear priority for all of us, but other countries, neighbors of Russia should also receive support from international donor community to strengthen civil society. We shouldn't also forget civil society in Russia. Pressure should be brought to on regime to free critics regime such as Alexei Navalny, Kara Murza, Ilya Yashin, Maria Panamarenka and others. A mechanism for including journalists and bloggers in prison exchanges should be also become a priority. Thank you.